Hello, my friends. Well, we have a problem. Or it's been going for a couple months, but this Sunday it went terrible. This whole side, it went completely off. It's cracked up. This been cracked a while, but I thought I would, but I thought I would get over uh, this spring and then fix it before the summer or something like that. When I don't use it as much. Now I'm hauling wood and so on. So I need the trailer every weekend or even in the weeks. So this went off and it hit the tire. You can see here it's shiny. It went between the tire and the frame and it didn't damage the tire. The tires, it's good. This is just because when I'm welding, it will go any hot metal on the tire. So now we have to weld this up, back together. And this is what I did for the other side. I put an extra under and much, much thicker on the outside and weld this back together and move this from up here uh, much further down so we will be pushing down here so now this is much steadier so I have to weld other side now and fabricate some metal for that side and when we are going and going at it we're gonna be making some changes here too instead of having one beam in the middle i'm gonna be putting two extras on the side one over here front and over to the other side also so we have more stability because when we're pulling with the winch it tends to go sideways because it twists twists the metal. So now I hope when I put three bars it will be better stability. Yes. Now we have welded up everything here back. Now I'm gonna be mounting this. This is from an exhaust clamp. Just took the nuts off and so on. This is gonna be mounting up here. Oh, sorry. Down here. Like this. So when you have some big logs or something that you want to strap down, you can. Uh, hook up the straps to this ring here. So we're gonna be welding this on here. Hello. Now we're next day. But I forgot my case on the GoPro, so the audios were terrible. So I'm gonna do be doing a voiceover. And uh, I've been fixing everything here. 
and I welded some nuts on the end so I could fit the greasers as you see here and also made a grease for a pin over there so now I can grease everything that's moving on it so now I'm gonna be welding those up here to make it stronger and a little bit rigid like you see now in the picture it's all welded back so now it's ready to take home put some paint on, paint on and uh, maybe some lights on it yeah 